All right. Today we have the first free to play unit. Um, also, my room is a little bit echoey. It's kind of empty right now. So I hope that's not too big of an issue. Anyway, we have the first free to play unit, Rum, which is um, a backline support, usually. But they decided to give her attack related stats on her holy relic. So when she uses her rupture card, which is this card, she gets 30% attack related stats. Very weird choice for a relic. I think everyone would have been much happier if they just gave her like a Ludo or a Roxy type relic that's just stats and CC. That would have been lovely. But it is what it is. Um, she has UR gear, not attack crit though. Uh, we might switch to it if she if if she's too underwhelming, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, that's the team. Uh, the issue is I wanted to run Rimuru, but Rimuru removes buffs on his turn. So if they have buffs and I want to use Rupture to do double damage, Rimuru's going to remove those buffs. I can't get the Rupture, so I can't run Rimuru. But we'll run her. Um, that's why we just have bond backline supports, more attack rate stats. We, we have a lot of basic stat support here, um, which is really nice. But I don't see this going too well. We'll try, obviously. But um, again... I don't think this is going to be uh, very successful, uh, but we'll see. Also, my I fixed my my uh, what's her name? Echidna, bro. I kept killing the one like one to call her Satella. She has an actual defense now. She has full yard gear. Look, good CC for being two six. Good CC for being two six. She had like sixty six point five. I'm also missing one outfit for her still. Uh, Ram uh, Ram has a lot like five five outfits for each slot. Not like leveled up, but it's good enough, right? And she's 4 6 in case we get her ultimate off. Now, I don't know. Um, yeah, it's only for the rupture skill. I thought maybe if I use the rupture skill and then a different one, then the same turn I get those. But no, it's just for the rupture skill. So this one. Now, the issue is. Uh, not the issue. The good thing is they buff. Um, they buff up. So we, we we have something going on here. I'll do this first in case they have dodge food. Oh, no, no. He had, he had good CC, right? Yeah, it should. Yeah, he should have CC food. Uh, we'll do this. Um, does he have retirement on Liz? He does not. Okay, well, we can just go crazy with uh, Echidna then. All right. And then hopefully uh, Margaret buffs next turn. Right? Hopefully. Echidna go crazy. This will do a lot more damage. Oh, I love Echidna. She's so cool. Don't forfeit, please. This is a rum showcase, please. But, I mean, look at her. She's so sick. This banner is definitely a skip, by the way. Okay, bro. Unless you're like me and you really like, um, like, I, I like unknown, but I'm like, don't put me in the same group as unknown players. I don't, uh, you've never seen me run some other, okay? That, that, I'm not running that cringe. I'm not running like red gold or attack seal cringe. I'm not running no questionable, um, aged girls on my team. Actually, I mean, I can't, well, to be fair, they're like, they're of age. They're 19, I think. Anyway, but, you know, I'm not that, I'm not that type of guy, unknown player. I like Rimuru. I like Echidna, you know, I like my, I like Fest Gother, that's it, okay, thank you. I think this is a bot though, because you'd always go, um, thingy. Now the thing is, I can actually just do this, this, and this, and because they get the cigarette buffs next turn, next turn, um, as so long as we survive, we will be, um, bing chilling, we'll be bing chilling, because they will have buffs next turn, um, because of cigarette, and then we can do rapture damage. Everyone. Oh, we got rank 2-2, two, two. okay. Damn! Alright, well, well, attack rate sets are gonna be lowered, so we're not gonna get that much back, but it's okay. We'll be okay. She's gonna die in one turn. Oh, no, okay. Um. Oh, she is going to die in one turn. Right, do you play this out? Do you guys uh, want to see this? If he lives, I'll do it. Oh, he didn't. Oh, actually, no, I will. The kid is broken, watch. Yeah, I don't know what they're thinking with the Rum Holy Relic. She's not, like, supposed to be a frontline unit. Uh, also, Rupture sucks, like, nowadays. High key. Like, everything is a white buff now, anyway. Um, but she wants... Uh, it's so annoying. She wants to uh, attack um, debuffed enemies, right? But I can't debuff them because I'm disabled. If I get her ultimate off, we kill everyone, by the way. Next turn. But I don't think that's going to be happening. Uh, so I'm going to cut. I also got Beatrice up um, because, okay. I also got Beatrice up because, um, what do you call it? The, um, uh, 
he doesn't really get buffs like that but he will maybe have a buff on melee and fraudulent next turn so we can go for big damage and then we can also seal them that's good uh beatrice got a, a, her holy relic uh, that's that one's cracked uh, it's 80 percent crit chance and 80 percent crit damage i don't know if that's gonna save her i think she'll be okay um like i think you can like make her like she'll be good but you can make her work in a video setting probably right if i do funky showcases okay they do have two buffs so i will do a, a rupture card there you go right buff here buff here there you go and then i don't think she kills him how much health does he have 67k she might kill him i will use this just in case right um okay, she did she did crit and that did look like good damage so hey you know what i'll i'll give it to her those 30 percent attack rate stats they do go crazy and he has Esarosa backline makes sense uh now we do need to get um some funky cards here i'll infect and then i'll attack with gother into the melee uh, yeah, we only have one ult removal, sadly. We didn't guess. We didn't guess. I can one of this, so we don't have a stun. Um, so that's unfortunate, but it's what it is. Uh, let's just do this, and then we do this. Uh, I kind of want to attack. I kind of don't want to attack. I'll, I'll throw out the rupture. Why not? Why not? You know, that's, that's the whole point. Let's see how much damage it does. Only one of them has a buff now. I'm gonna say it does like 130k. Maybe. Maybe that's giving her too much credit. 130k. Love to see it. Alright. Is is she going to survive? Zoj Ultimate is not going to do damage to me. Uh eh, it depends. He did get the he did get the debuff, so you know, cracked. He is still debuffed though, so Akira takes less damage and she has type advantage. Uh, wow. Wow. C66? That would at least, like, sort of explain it. He's 5'6. Damn. Do we have, like, a lot of darkness stacks? I didn't see. I'm surprised. Alright, so far, Rum has done 130k damage. Wow. I'm thinking, because, like, like the, well, the only team that I can see, like, actually buffing up is, like, a goddess team with Margaret. But they don't take damage. And then, like, because they get a damage reduction buff, so the rupture is going to be, like, sort of cancelled out. And then against the bond team, where we have type disadvantage. So, what's really the, the point of this unit again? Like, explain? Um, anyway. Alright, like, boom, there's no, they, they, like, only he, he's going to buff, but he, they, he's going to give them damage reduction. He has a damage reduction shield. Like, there's no... Like, this, this relic, I don't know, it, it really just was not thought out, I think. And by I think, I mean I know. Um, I was gonna seal the rank 2s, because I, I feel like he has a... Oh, okay, it did, it did, it did damage. Um, what do you call it? The... Um, oh, wow. She's on HP defense, by the way. I'm gonna give her attack gear at some point. Um, the... I can't think. I, I, I think he, he was gonna merge cards of King, but I was like, eh, if he doesn't, then I just look stupid, so. That's not gonna do damage. That did more than it should have. There you go. And melee card. Yeah. Alright, well, um, we can get a stun off here, which is very nice. So let's do that. Oh, we can get her ultimate, maybe. If he didn't. Oh. What? Why'd he give up? This is so painful to record because she i don't know like, like i'm just upset that they didn't even give her a relic that she can actually make use of like the rupture thing is so bad it should have been like at start of turn if all allies are of unknown race uh rank up all like all of her own cards so you can start with a stun with her right so like when she comes out of backline she starts with a stun if she if you draw one that would have been cool but it's also like kind of too RNG heavy. They should have just done a CC one. Anyway, they have debuffs on their team, so I'm not gonna use Gotha's card, right? Um, it's a bot too, so he will definitely um, cleanse here. So next turn, we can actually get the full rupture damage, and then that, that might be it for the video. Oh, jeez, Echidna is just so good.
Like, she is just so good. All right. No red timer either on the Liz. That's good. Let's see. All right. Buff card. Perfect. We can get Rapture now. Okay. One type of dis disadvantage, one type advantage, and one takes less damage from everyone. So, it works out. Yeah, it's not gonna do anything. That card sucks. That unit sucks. Um, okay, no, no stance, so that's really good for us because then I can just go crazy. Uh, there's no way we can get five Oak Age of Gotha, right? While also attacking? No. Okay. Uh, yoink, yoink. Uh, I'll move his card. No, well, I'll, I'll, I'll seal their buffs now, actually, in their rank twos. Okay, 180k, and can we get one crit? We cannot get one crit, but it did look like you did, like, like. I'm okay with that damage if it wasn't rupture like if that was like the, if that was just like a week she had and she did that damage because of the holy relic that'd been fine but because it's rupture and it's supposed to like it's such a niche skill so if you actually get it off the niche should be like a good damage increase i'm not happy with it right uh, you, you guys understand like it's not bad but it's not what it should be um what are attack rate stats now uh, so she jump up to like 200% crit, da crit damage, um, like 110, 107% like crit, um, no, 117 crit chance, and then like 30k attack. Again, not bad. Please use the rupture. Oh. Also, why attack with Gother? Like before stunning. Because if he stun me, remove those stats. Fuda. All right. Well, we have five voltage of Golther now. So next turn, please buff up. Oh, he can't buff up. That's annoying. Stop attacking! Stop attacking my kid now! Damn, she ain't do anything. She just has buffs. Wow. Yeah, they can't buff because Golther's sealed. Unlucky. Ah, uh, she dies here, right? Yeah. There, there are some. That's some base that's gone here. Um, let's see your attack rate stats now, and then we can. You know 31k attack well she's 118 crit so she'll go up to like 150 crit chance almost now so let's see rupture rupture and then just go through old i think we killed one here right okay it's same damage it did pretty much pr with when they had the rupture so if they had rupture it would have done like 270k here ish uh and i can live with that i think that's fine so we get our ultimate now too actually perfect i think gother buff runs out next turn though because that holy relic lasts like half a turn um but we'll see okay we don't <laughs> he he, he top decks a uh, oh okay removal sadly understandable but um yeah, well, I still want to get her ultimate because this, this is the last match. So I'll do this, this, and then I'll do this. And we hope we get her ultimate, and then we hope, I hope I get a Gotha card, and I can get back to full Oak Age. That'd be, like, fantastic. Okay. Okay, annoying. Um... There we go. There we go. Well, I'm scared he's gonna kill him. Hold on. We can do this. Then this. I'm still gonna do a lot of damage. And then I can't attack with her. She might actually kill. Gother don't kill. Alright, thank god. Because Gother, hey, that boy in his pulverized and max oak cage, he, he, does, he does do damn diddly dong damage, so... Um, that's perfect. Don't have two of them, please. Please. Oh, I'm just trying my best. I'm just trying. I'm just trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. Guys, I'm trying, but I can't. No, I'm gonna have to kill him. Oh, uh, yeah. We, we will. This one is, bro. Oh, double crit. Oh, uh, only one crit. What? I didn't target him, but I just thought, ah, oh, it's fine. He does. It's fine. It's fine. He's not going to even attack. He's going to do double old cage removal again. Oh, no, he did. Oh, he didn't remove uh, Rum's ultimate. Hold on. We're chilling. Perfect. Wait, this was actually all planned. All planned. Even bottom level on one HP. 
All right, there we go. Okay, we get the max damage ultimate. Woo! There we go. Field wipe. Now, her ultimate is Death Pierce ultimate. It literally doesn't do damage. So, there's no reason to be excited for this. Um, it just lowers the attack rate stats by a lot. Like, you don't do damage when you get hit by this. But, again, uh, it's Death Pierce ultimate. Now, even if it's a 6 6, it doesn't matter. That, that ultimate sucks. Korewado. Yikes, yeah, she, she lost her boss. And all sorts of go to support. Yeah, she's a... She's a goner. Um, let me do this for the attack rate stats, because I think we actually need those. And then, please just kill, and I can finish off the video. Anyway, that was uh, that was Holy Relic Rum. I hope you guys are really excited to craft this Holy Relic on Global and then use her out on the front line, right? 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 You want to use on the front line? Yeah, me too. Anyway, uh, that's it. Again, Bear Trees, I'm excited. Um, but that's it from me. Good job.